We'll update many are talking about tonight. Catherine, the Princess of Wales, has cancer. After weeks of widespread speculation over her health, the future Queen of England shared the diagnosis in a, vi a video released this afternoon, and here's a part of it. In January, I underwent major abdominal surgery in London, and at the time, it was thought that my condition was non-cancerous. The surgery was successful. However, tests after the operation and cancer had been present. So if you've been on social media the last few weeks, you've seen the speculation over Princess Kate's health. Our Verify team has been tracking what we do know about her medical situation and what is still unknown. So we know that she had what was described as abdominal surgery that happened on January 16th. And as you just heard in the video released today, we know the cancer was found in tests after that surgery. Now, we also know that she started treatment. Kensington Palace says it started in late of February. We don't know what kind of cancer Kate has though, nor do we know the specifics of her treatment. Um, other than that, she's undergoing chemo. She did say that in the video. We also don't know how long the treatment will last. We spoke with Dr. Ruben Mesa at Atrium Health today about the challenge Princess Kate has with sharing the diagnosis, particularly with her own children. And we know well that when someone is both a cancer patient, but a parent, that is a particularly difficult challenge. You know, trying to navigate that, the kids, particularly younger kids, uh, can, can sense that something is wrong. Their understanding of cancer usually is really quite limited, particularly if they're younger. Now, we've been following Catherine's announcement since it was released this afternoon. You can find full coverage right now on WCNC.com.